The capital city of Thailand and maybe the traffic jam capital of the planet, Bangkok is a fascinating, exciting, and incredible city to visit. Like many other capital cities, Bangkok never goes to sleep. There is always a hive of activity as people work around the clock in their various professions. With 8 million inhabitants living within the city, you will find yourself encountering every walk of life. From the super poor to the mega rich, they all congregate in one city, and each feels at home as the other. In this video, we are going to tell you the top 12 things to do and see in Bangkok. The video is going to be amazing, so make sure you stick to the end. Before starting the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. Now, let's get started. 12. Go for a drink on top of the city there are various places in Bangkok where you can go for a drink at the end of the day, but none will have the view of Bangkok that the Vertigo and Moon Bar or the Labua Rooftop Bar has. Sitting on the 61st floor of the Banyan Tree Hostel, you can look out and see the beautiful skyline of Bangkok in all of its glory. As soon as you reach the top, you are straight outside, so this is not the place to be if you are afraid of heights. The designers have made the rooftop in such a way that you get a complete 360 degree view of the city with no obstructions. 11. Eat out at Chinatown Every major city has its own Chinatown, and Bangkok is no exception to this. You know you have arrived when you walk through the ceremonial Chinese gates and into Chinatown itself. Packed full of street stalls and restaurants, the choice of places to eat will be endless. Nowhere else in Bangkok you will get to try as many different kinds of Chinese food as you can here, especially at such good prices. If it is gold you are on the lookout for, it is said that this is also the best place in Bangkok to look. 10. Take a stroll through Lumpini Park at over 500,000 square meters, Lumpini Park provides the people of Bangkok with a much-needed break from the hustle and bustle of the city. The name of the park originated from the Lord Buddha who was born in Nepal. It is not unusual when you walk through the park to see the other, Thai general practicing their Tai Chi, or a romantic couple relaxing by the side of the lake. At the weekends, the park is full of people taking part in all sorts of activities, so a great time to go is early morning or just before sunset. 9. Climb the Sathon Unique Tower Before the financial crisis hit the world a few years ago, a huge 49-story skyscraper was being built in the heart of Bangkok. But when the crisis hit the building, work stopped and the tower was never completed. Now it sits there abandoned, far too big for anyone to do anything with. Some sites recommended climbing the tower, but this is dangerous and not allowed. A few years ago, some bloggers slash vloggers had criminal charges filed against them for posting material online showing them climbing the tower. 8. Spend an evening in Nana Plaza Situated just outside the BTS station called Nana is a place called Nana Plaza. Many people think that Nana Plaza is the largest sex complex in the world today. 7. Visit the Bangkok National Museum the Bangkok National Museum is home to the largest collection of artifacts and Thai art in all of Thailand. The museum was first opened by King Rama V to show off all the gifts that his father had given to him. There are many interesting things to see in the museum, such as Chinese weapons, precious stones, puppets, clothing and textiles, and con masks. If you go to the museum on a Thursday, you can be given a tour in English to give you a greater understanding of everything in the museum. 6. Shop till you drop at the Siam Paragon The high-end shopper's paradise, a hugely popular shopping mall that houses many different shops for high-end fashion designers, Southeast Asia's largest aquarium, a huge multiplex cinema, and enough restaurants to feed you for a lifetime. There are over 250 shops inside the mall, most of which are frequented by the well-heeled Thais and foreigners. Various car manufacturers including Ferrari and Lamborghini also have showrooms within the complex, so if you have deep pockets, you are sure to find what you are looking for. 5. Take a boat trip along the Chao Phraya River some people refer to Bangkok as the Venice of the East. This is due to the Chai Phraya River flowing through Bangkok and all of the little canals that feed off of it. The river is the lifeblood of Bangkok. Even today, 50,000 people still go to work on one of the many ferries that go up and down. Taking a boat trip down the river is fascinating as you will see high-rise condominiums and fancy hotels in one part, whilst you will see wooden shacks and children playing in the water in other parts. Feel free to get on and off at any of the shops the ferries make to further explore the city. 4. Take a trip around Chatuchat Market 
If you like shopping, you need to check this place out. If you hate shopping, you need to give this place a wide berth. With over 8,000 stalls covering 27 acres of space, this is one of the largest markets in the world. Open every Saturday and Sunday. It attracts nearly 200,000 visitors a day. You will find everything you could ever imagine for sale here, and mostly at local prices, rather than tourist prices. It is certainly worth picking up a map before you go to avoid you being lost in the market for hours. 3. Ride the Sky Train there is one way to get around Bangkok at any speed while keeping cool and that is to jump aboard one of the sky trains. With air-conditioned carriages, there is no better way to get around. In most instances, you are high above the traffic below giving you a view of the city, but also the train takes the most direct route. With nearly every part of Bangkok, you would want to visit having a train station. Travel could not be simpler. 2. Visit the Grand Palace of all the places to visit in Bangkok, the Grand Palace is the most famous attraction there is. You simply cannot move to another city until you have taken the time to visit here. The palace at one time was the king's home as well as the place where the government of Thailand carried out its work. A trip to the palace can take many hours as there are over 214,000 square meters to cover. Be aware of potential scams when outside the palace and only pay the entrance fee when you are actually going in. 1. Visit Wat Po to see the reclining Buddha A visit to Wat Po is a must for any traveler to Bangkok. It is the home to the reclining Buddha, which stands 15 meters tall and 46 meters long. The feet alone are measured at over 5 meters. The whole statue is covered in gold leaf and looks incredible when you get up close. Inside the temple, there are 108 bowls and on the way into the temple, you can buy coins for the bowls. The history behind this is that Buddha completed 108 positive actions on his way to becoming perfect. Whilst you are at the temple, you can also stop for a while to receive a traditional Thai message. Thank you guys for watching. Let us know your opinion in the comment section below. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Stay safe and we'll be back soon with another video.